Hey guys, Noxia here. So, I first tried playing Path of Exile like two years ago, but I didn't get very far. I started with a melee character, but I didn't make past like Act Two. I was I was playing blind and didn't know much about the game, and the passive tree skill tree overwhelmed me, and I didn't know what I was doing because there was a lot of menu, and I I was playing a melee character. which i didn't like so i quit but then again i gave it another shot during the application application league and i reached like around eight acts but unfortunately my build was like too squishy and i was in pan of like the active gameplay i was doing uh, means i was doing like a minions with a praising pulse but uh, i was in pan of like how that build was failing so i quit after like eight acts so Then again, in Necropolis League, I tried to experiment with like hybrid minion build, uh, but I wasn't fan of like the league mechanic. Uh, so after just two acts, I quit. Then uh, I saw some news about the the settlers of Kalagarn League and the quality of life changes and the hype around uh, this league uh, convinced me to try again. since there was a lot of melee changes so i started this league with a melee character but i end up deleting it after like just tutorial boss because i i i i don't means like how melee characters feel in this game uh, so i don't know means i can't pinpoint why, what or why but i don't like it so then i checked max rule and find a build which uh, i was interested in uh, it was jumancer so i created a new character which and started my journey so this time things were much better i was following the guide so i felt more confident so on the first day i casually cleared like arc two acts then eventually i proceed to like act five and at some point i got two ball ball gems Ball skeleton and abs ball absolution gem. So after these two gems, my clearing speed like improved uh, significantly. So after that, I successfully cleared like all the ten acts and without any major issues. So the league mechanic, uh, like the settlers of Kalaga, is very nice because I was actively collecting resources for like uh, my. Uh, settlement and it was the active part of my gameplay and for like one two hours I was clearing like simple maps and I was collecting resources and then after my one two hour session is done I was going to like uh, the Calaga and I was managing like uh, gold spent and how much resource uh, I am getting and uh, the shipping to other continent and other stuff so which I I liked a lot. Uh, in comparison to affliction and uh, necropolis which the last two leagues i played it is like significant step up uh, and it is uh, like way different experience for me and so this is a thumbs up from me and i am excited so we see what more significant changes they are going to make so apart from that so after the arts I, when i started doing like fight maps I encountered my first real obstacle in mental space. So white maps were dropping a lot of scare ups, essences, and other maps. So managing space became a constant struggle. So to solve this, like I bought the first plot starter pack, which includes one tab, 200 points, and a weapon effect, blood weapon effect. So from that uh, currency, I purchased uh, more tabs. So I have currently like a lot of tests, so I am much more confident. And I, 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 for this uh, like my goal is like try pushing like yellow and red maps. I am not particularly focused on like doing bossing or or anything. I want to play this like as much as possible and like maybe. to get to like tier 16 or something like that but i don't know if my build is like viable so i love this leak and i am also excited about like path of exile 2 and recent uh, news about like how they are like you all the 100 bosses are unique and they how they are improving like the main melee default attacks and all so that's it 
if you like this video then give a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel thanks for watching and happy gaming bye